A few weeks ago, a lovely lady and her husband came um, to the uh, Pure Energy Healing Academy for a coffee. Um, as I was um, putting the coffee out in the uh, little coffee maker, um, I said to her, would you like sugar? And I don't think I've ever seen a reaction so dramatic. No, that's evil, she said. I went, I beg your pardon? She said, that's evil. I said, what's evil? She said, sugar. I went, wow. She says, Mark, I'm a biologist. I work as a scientist. And I can tell you this now. Sugar is the most evil product on the market. Well, her husband was smiling. He's a solicitor in London. And um, you could see he completely agreed. What do I think? Absolutely 100% agree. What I've realized over these years is that sugar feeds illness. If you have a body free from sugar, your body can heal quicker. There was a man many, many years ago who wrote a book and I believe the book was called Pure, White and Poison. Even back then, people knew that sugar was very bad. How bad? I've never researched, so I cannot say. But I know that since I've been alkaliding my body, clearing myself of sugar as much as possible, keeping away from processed foods, keeping away from refined sugar, I feel so much better. I feel healthier, I feel stronger. I feel myself. So if you ask me today, Mark, what is the most important thing I can do for my physical health? I would say, start by trying to alkaline your body and stay away from as much sugar as you possibly can. Sugars are good for you, I have been told, but you can get them from Mother Nature in the sense of keeping away from refined sugar and maybe taking it in some fruits. Not too much though, but just be careful with what you eat. Listen to your body is the, um, the message today. And like that lovely lady said, sugar is evil. And I have actually heard that it's many times more addictive than drugs. Some certain drugs, they say cocaine and things like this, I wouldn't know, but I do know that it is hard to be the sugar fix. Chocolates. Oh! But I'm trying. So let's do it together. Have a lovely day, everybody.